So what we have is three cups of sugar. Yes. And a light. There, well, light's good. Yes, there we go. And three cups of sugar, one and a half cups of milk. Okay. Okay, and now we are using the good old-fashioned original cocoa, natural, unsweetened. Very nice. Hershey's cocoa. We're going to do two-thirds of cocoa. Two-thirds of the can? Two, no. Oh, no. Sorry, sir. <laughs> two-thirds of a cup. Okay. okay. Remember that two-thirds of a cup actually means that that's three parts out of a whole, and we're going to do two but yes, as a child, I think I was in the kitchen. Well, you know, we were all so far apart, so who really knows? I just remember being by Mama's side all the time cooking is what I remember. That's what you call packed cocoa. Oh, so you want to pack it, but not super pack it. Just kind of... Right. All right, now, I'm stirring all those ingredients together. We'll continue stirring so this mixture becomes an actual solution. Okay, so now it looks like a mess, but we really do wait for it just to become come to, to a start boiling. Raging boil. Raging boil, as opposed to a regular boil. Yes. Now it's not the same if you don't have a plate on the side to be able to dip the boiling syrup onto the plate and let it cool for a second and uh -huh. lick it. That is how uh, you know. And does it have to be a Dora plate? <laughs> it does not have to be a Dora plate, but you don't want to do it on a styrofoam plate. If you do it on a styrofoam plate, you're going to be eating styrofoam. Oh, that's no good. That definitely changes the taste. <laughs> so, yes, we will probably wait. Oh. We'll be waiting a moment, but a dash of salt. Whew, that's not much of a dash. <laughs> where's your, where's your? Oh, and it's steaming. Yep, it's a coming. Because this is a favorite of the family. Oh, see, it's starting to boil My a bit. siblings, my two older siblings, Robin Donnell Welch Dukes and Zona Sue Welch. <laughs> 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 they both love us. They go. Oh, Priscilla, you made fun. Well, this is Susie's reaction. Oh my God, you made fun. Oh God, I'm going to be in a coma by the end of the day. If I fudge. <laughs> and the robot comes in. Did you make any fudge? Oh, 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 I got to get my piece of fudge. <laughs> yeah, so it is a favorite. <laughs> Robin can make the fudge too, but I don't think it's like her favorite thing to make. She's really good about the cakes and the pies. See, I don't care nothing about the cakes and the pies. That's what she took from mom. Mm. See this spoon right here? Yes. This cooking spoon's been with me a long time. Uh -huh. It's pretty scary looking at it. Does it scare you? No. Are you still going to eat the fudge if I use a spoon in this pot? Was it outside at all? No, it's been washed and cleaned in oh, hot water. Then... It's been bleached and everything else. You put bleach on it? Yeah, there's been bleach. I mean, Did you wash the bleach off? I put a little bit of bleach in my dish dish water every, you know, probably once a week. <laughs> so, come on in, Dad. No kidding to her. Right. <laughs> of course you're not kidding to me. You're married to me. We're one. No, we're not married. We're in here. unison, baby. She's just here. Hey, I got the paper, piece of paper that says so. Yeah, he really loves me. He just don't want anybody to know it. <laughs> So this goes on for like, you have a certain time or, oh, is this when you do that trick? Okay. You're telling me about the trick with the water? Well, I will do that trick. Now we're not ready for the trick, but I'll go ahead and okay. show you. Okay. It, I let it keep boiling. Cause if, if you will stand here, if you'll stand here and be patient, let it boil like this and keep stirring it every so many seconds, it will get done faster. But if you've got something you want to get done and you don't want to keep standing here, yeah, go ahead and turn it down to about medium and let it do a slow boil. And if you had to like run downstairs to do something, you could leave it kind of like on low to let it keep cooking and drag the whole thing out. But if you want it to get done, be concise, keep it up high. Let's keep it raging here. The cold water is the test. And some, some women or some cooks, bakers, whatever, are going to, you know, use a thermometer. I don't even know if they do this, but this is my mama's old trick that she learned from her mother. 
Yeah, see, see that one goes... kind of went running at the bottom? Yeah, it's a so little we flat. So it's definitely not ready. Yeah, it's flat. This solution of chocolate is so not apparently not. at the proper temperature yet to solidify because as it hits the water, it simply mis mixes with the water basically. See, I could, oh my, I could get a spoon and I could stir it. Let's see. See how it's mixing? A it's little... chocolate milk. Yeah, yeah, like chocolate water. Or, or sewer water. Yes. <laughs> now there's a little bit of content a in there. Bit. A little bit. A little bit of solid sedimentation there. Yeah, there you go. Okay, we're going to let it keep boiling. It's still a boiling. Now, have you noticed how it's the evaporation though that's going on? Yes. How it's not as high as it was earlier? I mean, so you're is, losing water. Yeah, so it's you, thickening it, up. Yes, you're all losing water, and look how. Um, what does the worm look more? You see how the, the boil bubbles are even small? They're like close oh, to the Oh, they're smaller. They're not bigger. Okay, yes. yes. Maybe. Okay, let's see if it's gotten any thicker. Wait. Okay, see it? Yep. They are thickening up a little bit more than before. Well, it's thickening, my mind. It is thickening. Okay. Now, I'm going to go ahead and turn it down just a tad. Because I tend to get distracted a little easily. No, I really don't like the monkey. I'm, I'm way over that monkey. I, I see me. I, this is the best way to clean the stove. <laughs> we don't have a script that we're going by. I can take it. Yeah, I've never measured. Some people would say two cups of chopped nuts. I just kind of look at it. So, uh, I'm going to eat some one. But it'll be plenty. Your wife has now put a whole puddle on her plate. That's a good sign. Oh. That it's probably time to test it again. Isn't that weird? I like the one they're This is doing. actually looking mm -hmm. cool. Yeah, I, I eat more of the fudge when it's cooking like this than anything. Okay, here we go. Hey, Miss Kay, the cook, and then she's being a scientist. You're oh, getting whoa. a big puddle. That is not you got. Yeah, you got like a two puddle. Oh my gosh. Can we have oh some? God, y'all are so crazy. <laughs> Can we have yeah, some? I mean, you know, and then she gets the nuts. Yeah, this hey, don't one. take all our nuts either. Hey, those are the chopped nuts, Rebecca! Get out of here! <laughs> Get out of here! Half a stick uh, of a stick. That's a fourth of a cup. Okay, and then we gotta put a little bit. Yeah, we can't lick anymore because we gotta have enough for the fudge to actually make fudge. And if you wanna lick anything, go find Rebecca because she took all of it. So how much vanilla? Honestly, I think it's two teaspoons. This is the part I just kind of put some in there. Okay. All right, and we are going to stir it. All right, so she added the, the pecans. She put yeah. the pecans in the, or the pecans if you're from around right here. She put pecans in the fudge. The pecans are in the fudge. And there's And Rebecca. And Rebecca is not getting any more. I'm not. I'm yes. done. I've yes. had my fill. She had her, her, her portion. It's, see, I don't like this crap. It gets hard on the plate. That's, well, when that's, done, that's why you usually wait till it solidifies and chop it with a knife. Right. That's when it's nasty tasting. It feels like it's all chalking in your mouth. Yeah, freeze that face. I like creamy. The doctor says she should just, should just smile more often. Okay, Pete, would you like to stir it? I just to to stir see it. My it doctor tells like. everyone that they should go see me because I make everyone feel so much better. They need to go see, you need to go see this lady named Rebecca. She will, she just makes everything hey, so much she's better. She's my sister. sister. She's so. my baby sister. We're almost eight years apart. It was my nurturing that made but her the really, she is today. I, I tell them that that's a joke. <laughs> I don't know why she tells them that. They believe her. Are you a massage hey, therapist? Hey, hey, hey. I actually tried to smother her with pillow. <laughs> That's why I can deal with such it's crazy terrible. people. I did take her to the strawberry pageant when no. she cried and begged to go. That's why I have so much empathy on people. But it's also why I have a troubled adult life because I still feel bad. Oh my god, now I know you're So when do I get to eat? Wow, in the nick of time. Almost. We almost had a prank. We almost had a prank. <laughs> what the heck? Are you? <laughs> this is my fault. And can you believe both these women are college educated? <laughs>
What is that? University of Florida? <laughs> this is my Well, I went to UNM. <laughs> University of Florida. Oh. This I don't have So a it's in the Florida system, thing. right? That's not so much. I don't have a plug for this thing. Oh, you do now. Yeah, this plastic bag's working really well. <laughs> okay, Pete, so the point of this though is uh -huh. we are down once you set oh, we'll the pot. This. In the cold water. In the cold water. To get rid of the heat quickly. Okay, I think it's ready to pour up actually. That's how thick it is. Now. So can you see the sugariness around the sides of the pot? Yeah, I thought that was uh, the, the parts of that spoon coming off. Good inference. Mm. You were wrong, but good inference there. <laughs> and if we don't have any food tomorrow for Christmas dinner, we will have a video to show why. Drinking. Now, what? She's supposed to be cooking now? See how thick it is? Oh, that's we good almost stuff. went too far, but this is when it's oh, good. No, that's good. It's like a big thick candy bar. Yeah, I mean this is like the I mean home plate thick fudge. Um you can tell where you put that stuff. Yeah, that's why I okay. scraped out. Yeah. It still tastes like fudge.